we are checking out another pair of shoes. We have bam, another pair of Under Armors. These are Speedform Fortices 2. Uh, I actually returned my other lightweight ones, and you can check out my other video to why I returned those. I got these Fortices 2s because I needed something with a little more shoe strength to them. Um, so before I go on a quick little run with these, I just want to do a little preview of, you know, them being brand new. What I think they do remind me of the speed forms. Uh, they don't have that little backing, but I mean, they look good. Not a huge fan of red, but uh, I can't remember the other color they had, but it was red or these. Um, so again, they have a nice little grip. It does have that kind of like fly knit style material. Um, so it should be like, it has a little bit of breathe. These on the inside say run strong. I don't know if you can even make that out. Nah. They do say run strong, and then I will um, speed form. So you kind of see these are kind of like a, a power shoe that is what they're kind of going for design-wise. They kind of all say like run fast or run distance, uh, depending on kind of what they're designed for. Um, but I'm a huge fan of the speed forms. Probably the best shape I've been in was when I was running in speed forms. I mean, it's also, you know, I know it's a, not a strong correlation, but it's just the shoes that were helping me out training a lot of summer. So I'm kind of sticking with them. Um, but yeah, um, these were a good fit in the store. Um, I did a few little jogs in it. Um, so I'm about to take these for a little run. I just wanted to kind of do a little quick little preview of what they look like. Uh, so that's them, you know. And, and then uh, I'll give my little what I think of them after we're done. All right. All right, just to give you guys an idea of how they fit. So I just got back from my run and I love them. Um, so you kind of see, I have like a, a weird foot, but there's where my big toe is. Um, they felt great on the run. Um, just to kind of show you, you know, uh, they don't really slide, um, which is good. Um, I never really bothered me on the run. Now, it is really cold out. It's about 28 degrees where I ran. And I, I'm using, I usually run in thin socks, um, but they have so much airflow through this whole front area right here. My dog's like playing with me. They have so much airflow through the area right here that it did actually feel good. My feet aren't too sweaty. I mean, they do feel a little sweaty now after my run. I did about four miles, um, but the airflow right there was really nice. Um, so yeah, just to kind of show you the roll. I mean, my foot's kind of a picture. Well, so it just shows you how it kind of fit and we'll go into a little more detail uh, from another perspective. But I just wanted to show you guys that. All right, so I just went on about a four mile run, a little over and use the speed forms. Got a little bit of dirt on them now, you see. Uh, I really like these shoes. Um, so again, I come from about a, a, the, the speed forms. This is like my second running shoe that I have. Um, used a lot of speed on them, uh, a lot of like one minute sprints, uh, stuff like that. Um, so again, these are the Fortis 2s. Um, so again, speed forms, Fortis 2s, um, same size, size 11. Uh, but I still like shoes fit me differently, um, different, like depending on the mesh material. Um, so again, you know, I paid for all these shoes too. I did buy them at like 40% off or something at the outlets, but I just like Under Armour shoes. Um, I like Under Armour as a brand. But just to kind of give a comparison of like what the difference here. Now, when I did run in these, uh, to sit out good little. Now, when I ran in these, I did feel like this had a little more uh, cushion. You probably can see it the best in the back. You see the difference in the cushion there. Um, I didn't have any slippage and I run in thin socks, like compression tight socks. Um, but I also do wear like thicker socks too sometimes. So I'll give a more detailed review probably after like maybe three, two, three weeks of uh, use, um, and try to see how they're holding up. Um, just as a quick look, a little quick mini review. I, I enjoyed the shoes. Um, they felt similar to the speed forms. Um, as I kind of talked about in the little where I showed how they fit on my foot. Um, the mesh was real nice. It, it's 28 degrees outside, um, so it's cold, but my it was bringing air to my feet, and I noticed it right away when I was running with my dog to start. Um, I was like, oh, okay, this is nice because I hate sweaty feet. I hate getting my feet uh, a little sweaty, so that would probably be real nice in the summer. Again, it's winter right now. Um, but see, I, I kind of need a shoe that I can use for uh, PT being in the Army, um, so kind of doing up and down push-ups and stuff like that. I can't have shoes that slip. Um, and then, so that's real nice. Um, to also kind of give another look, uh, these are another pair. Um, these are the, oh man, the, the Bandit 3s. <laughs> Sorry, I had to look and see what they're exactly called. Um, so kind of another like, dis this one's considered a distance shoe. This one's considered like a strength running shoe, like a power shoe. Um, so you kind of see, you know, how, 
how they look. Um, I'm doing like a review currently on these, um, but I actually prefer these over these um, to kind of put in perspective. So I, I really like the Fortis 2s, you know, I, and I can't talk too much because um, I only just took them on one run, but they fit real well. I'm always iffy on new shoes. So it's nice to have a shoe that I was like, okay, this, this feels good. Uh, I didn't worry about my foot slipping or I didn't, I didn't really think about my feet at all. Also kind of cool. It just show this texture off in the back too. It's, it's kind of nice. I don't know. I just, it has a good looking shoe. Like I said, red's not my favorite color. University of Kentucky, blue. Um, but yeah, so that's a little quick mini review of the shoes. Again, I think these, re these they, they say $99.99. Uh, I think they were on sale and then another 40% off. Um, so that's like your little information on them. Again, size 11s. Um, you always got to kind of always recommend trying a shoe in store, you know, given the good fit. Um, but sometimes you may want to see what other people think. So if you guys like this and you like the videos, be sure to like and subscribe. Um, check out my other videos if you're trying to look at shoes. If you got any questions, let me know. I'll be sure to answer.